Does anyone know what destructive recording and editing are? No. Tell us, Mr. Audio. With linear recorders like analog and digital tape, the recording functions are destructive, meaning that when the tape is rolling and the record button is pushed, whatever had been on the track at that point is erased and replaced with new audio. Destructive editing happens on these machines when the tape is cut, material is removed, and the selects are then spliced together. Conversely, Almost all operations on nonlinear systems like digital audio workstations, even though they may appear to mimic destructive recording and editing on the timeline, are usually non-destructive. That is, when recording and editing on DAWs, the original material is generally unaltered. However, even on nonlinear systems, some operations can be destructive. Although destructive generally has a negative connotation, sometimes making permanent changes to the original material is desirable. For instance, when redrawing the samples to eliminate ticks and clicks, it's usually preferred that these changes be permanent. Also, destructive recording on nonlinear systems, where the previous material is erased on a track when the record button is pushed, might in some cases actually be desirable if there are constraints on the available disk space. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.